This video outlines in short the initial steps of the process to create an initial clinical trial application. It explains how to populate the introductory information of the dossier, the title of the trial and the sponsor organization. And how to fill in the first two sections of the dossier, the form, and the member state concerned, or MSC. Once you are logged in CTIS, on the right side of the landing page, click on the New Trial button. In the pop-up window, there are two fields for the title of the trial and the sponsor organization. Type the full title of the trial in the first field. In the search organization area, use the search organization function to find the sponsor of the clinical trial application. This can be the sponsor you are working for or on behalf of, in case of a clinical research organization. Once the two fields are complete, click on the Create button and a draft of the clinical trial will be created. You can see the full title of the trial, its number and the application status in Draft, below the tabs. On the left side, you can see the sections of the application which need to be filled in with structured data and documents. On the right side, you can see four buttons. You can use the check button anytime, to identify the mandatory fields in the various sections that have not been filled in. When you click on it, exclamation marks indicate the sections that those fields can be found. Use the save button to save the progress up to that moment. Use the cancel button to cancel your application. You can use it only while your trial application is in draft mode. Once all the necessary information has been populated to the various sections, and the application is complete and ready use the Submit button to submit your application. On the left side, the first section in the list is that of the form. In the form details, two subsections for the cover letter of the application and for the deferral publication dates need to be filled in. Click on the lock button and then on the arrow of the cover letter area to expand it. There are many fields in the application marked with an asterisk. Those fields are compulsory and must be filled in. Use the Add Document button to upload the cover letter document. Drag and drop the document on the gray area, or click on the gray area and select the document from your files. Click on the Attach button. The document has been uploaded in the field for the cover letter. Click on the Lock button in the next subsection. Use the drop-down menu to select the category of the trial. And use the field below to insert the justification for the selected trial category. More information on trial categories and deferral rules can be found on the e-learning of this module. Moving to the MSC section, you can specify in which MSCs you intended to conduct the trial and select the MSC that is the proposed reporting member state, or RMS. Click on the lock button and the add member states button will appear. Click on it and in the pop-up window, use the drop-down menu to select the first member state. Click the button add another, to add more member states. In this example Austria and Germany have been selected. In the subjects column, insert the number of the subjects that are expected to participate in the trial in each member state. Use the radio buttons to indicate which member state you want to propose as RMS. You can use the bin icon to remove a member state that was selected by mistake. Once you have filled in the required details, the Add button becomes active. Click on it to add the selected member states. The area below conveys to the user read-only information on the countries outside of the European Economic Area, or EEA where the trial is intended to be conducted, including the estimated total population for EEA and outside EEA patients. This information is populated in the part 1 of the dossier. This video is part of the CTIS training program. For more information on how to fill in the sections of form and the MSC in the dossier of an initial trial application, you may visit our training platform and our additional materials.